In today's video, we're looking at the most luxurious cars that the world has to offer. Mercedes S650 Pullman. It's not easy to improve on perfection, but Mercedes has managed to do exactly that with their Maybach S650 Pullman edition. Measuring just over 21 foot, the S650 Pullman is 41 inches longer than the standard Maybach sedan allowing for an upgraded interior and a whole lot more road presence. Exterior-wise, apart from the stretched body, this Pullman features a redesigned vertical bar grille with a chrome mesh insert, some new headlights and plenty of smart-looking LED lighting. Inside sits a vis-a-vis -vis seating arrangement, with two forward-facing airplane-style recliners for those long journeys and two rear-facing jump seats for when you need to get in and out in a hurry. The S650 Pullman wants for absolutely nothing, and with a price tag of $615,000, that is only to be expected. Rolls-Royce Cullinan Rolls-Royce's recipe for luxury motoring hasn't changed all that much in the past hundred years, so loyal customers and die-hard fans were a little taken aback with the announcement of the first SUV to enter the high-end manufacturer's lineup. The Rolls-Royce Cullinan, named after the world's largest diamond, is the biggest, baddest Rolls to date, truly setting the benchmark for luxury 4x4s. Staying true to the badge, the Cullinan benefits from all the comfort, quality and hand-built attention to detail that makes Rolls-Royces famous. It might ride higher than any of its predecessors, but it's still a Rolls through and through. Behind the brand's trademark Pantheon radiator grill, sits a twin-turbocharged 6.75-litre V12 petrol engine that produces 563 brake horsepower and a 0 to 60 of 5 seconds. On paper, the Cullinan sounds like it should be a loud and brutish beast. However, thanks to its namesake, that is, of course, not the case. Everything about the Cullinan is centred around comfort and style. The electronic self-leveling air suspension proactively adjusts to acceleration, steering cues and the road ahead to give a magic carpet-like ride quality. The inside is absent of any road noise and the interior detailing is as luxurious as they come. Bentley Mulsanne Extended Wheelbase Limited Edition this limited edition Bentley Mulsanne has taken an already stunning vehicle and made it even more luxurious through some not-so-subtle modifications. The length of the vehicle has been extended by 25 centimeters to provide extra legroom in the rear and make space for a bespoke interior. On the outside, the limited edition is offered in only two paint finishes, either black velvet or black onyx. Once the main shade is applied, a gold flake pinstripe is hand-painted along the length of the car's 6-meter body, giving it a truly custom look. The exterior also benefits from upgraded chrome alloys and a double diamond quilt pattern mesh grille that sets the car off perfectly. The outer looks are stunning, but the inside is where this Bentley really starts to shine. To make use of the extra legroom, Bentley has completely redesigned the seating into one that rivals even the most luxury of private jets. The leather recliners are separated by a handcrafted center console that houses all of the technological goodies, and the interior also benefits from embroidered detailing that features some unique artistry depicting the City of London's skyline. As with the rest of the Molsan range, the limited edition model is powered by a 505 brake horsepower 6.75 litre turbocharged V8 engine that will accelerate it from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 5.5 seconds. Not bad for an ultra luxury limo. Maybach GLS 600. The newest Maybach from Mercedes is a luxury-focused version of the German brand's largest SUV, the GLS, which in standard form is regarded by many as an already luxury 4x4. The Maybach GLS 600 might share the same chassis and body as its less refined brother, but these cars are two different beasts entirely. Styling changes include an entirely redesigned front end, 
a facelifted front grille and a reworked rear bumper. It's also fitted with multi-beam LED headlights as standard, as well as a set of 23-inch Maybach alloys. Other notable parts include active running boards that automatically deploy when a door is open to make getting in easier, and adjustable air suspension that will lower the car further if any climbing is too undignified. The interior of the Maybach GLS is similar in terms of size and legroom to that of the standard SUV. But as you would expect, there have been many improvements and refinements. Buyers can also specify the option of a four-seat model as opposed to six that comes with a pair of reclining leather chairs, a fixed rear console which houses a climate control panel, two fold-away tables and an optional champagne cooler. Other standout options include a 64-color ambient lighting system, a pair of touchscreen displays, and full-body massaging seats. The twin-turbo 550 brake horsepower 4.0-litre V8 engine is pulled out of an AMG GT supercar and pulls the Maybach GLS 600 from 0 to 60 in 4.9 seconds. Lexani Mercedes Sprinter B6 Real You might not have heard of Lexani Motors before, but in the world of luxury vehicles, they're famous for customizing unassuming cars and vans into bespoke travel companions. Their interiors are routinely compared to those found in multi-million dollar yachts and private jets, with each being crafted using only the finest materials, progressive tech, and unrivaled attention to detail. The Lexani Real is their top-of-the-line model and is the chosen transportation for A-list celebrities, professional sportsmen, and even Donald Trump. There's not a lot to say about the exterior of the Real except for the fact that it's encased in armor plating and bulletproof glass. There's also the addition of some nice shiny chrome alloys and a less van-like paint job. But these vehicles are all about the interior, more so than any other luxury ride. Inside, you will find an almost hotel-like studio with handcrafted Italian leather seats, a fully fitted kitchen, Luxury WC complete with ceramic toilet and gold-plated sink, marble floors and a hidden coat rack. Everything that you could possibly need for a cross-country business trip or a spontaneous venture into Vegas. Depending on what optional extras you choose, such as the 3D TV, wine cellar and hidden coffee machine, the Real will set you back between $450,000 to $500,000. BMW M760 Li BMW is far more well known for its sporty saloons and soccer mum 4x4s, but nevertheless, the German manufacturer knows how to put together a luxury ride. The 7 Series has always been BMW's most executive motor, but up until now it has never been able to rival the refinement that's found in its competitors. The 2020 rendition of the 7 Series has created a class of its own, combining luxury chauffeured comfort with the speed and performance of track-destined machines. The M760 Li is the limousine version and adds a few extra inches to the already stretched business saloon. The 6.6-litre V12 that purrs behind the giant kidney grille sends this spaceship from 0 to 60 in 3.6 seconds, making it the second-fastest BMW in the entire lineup, which is pretty amazing considering its sheer size and weight. Inside of the Li7 series is a tailor-made interior that's being geared towards both the driver and the passengers. There's controllable ambient lighting that wraps around the entirety of the cabin, touchscreen displays, and optional massage chairs that are designed to offer ultimate relaxation between meetings. One of the most advanced features is the motion control dash, where you can change everything with simple hand gestures, including the music volume, aircon, and even the sat-nav. Land Rover Velar SV Autobiography the Range Rover Velar SV Autobiography is a high-performance SUV that prioritizes comfort over handling, which is what sets it apart from most of its rivals. 
With enough power to get it from 0 to 60 in under 4.5 seconds, the Velar is far from being sluggish, but speed is not the name of the game for this British icon. Outside, the Velar looks much the same as any of the other autobiographies, with only minor cosmetic adjustments here and there. Inside, though, is a completely different story. The quilted leather seats include a 20-way heating and cooling system, and massage points are standard. The steering wheel has been redesigned to feel more sporting, and the dash has also had a complete makeover. All the controls are touchscreen, but feature a digital knurled dial to give a more analogue feel. The Range Rover Velar SV Autobiography is the most luxury mid-size 4 to 4 to come out of Britain, and is quite the status symbol amongst rural Brits. Audi A8L Extended The A8L is Audi's answer to the luxury car market and what they have on offer in the extended version is nothing short of a masterpiece. The A8L Extended is not just an extra-long wheelbase car with a few extra inches of legroom. This is a full-length six-door limousine that is custom-made to order. The 20.9-foot sedan is exclusive, to say the least, and no expense has been spared in making it fit for the royalty that will be its most likely passengers. Stepping inside, you're greeted by sublime luxury and plush design. All of the six leather seats are front-facing and feature individual sunblinds. There are touchscreen smart displays throughout and a main 12.3-inch screen that acts as the interactive dash. Under the hood of this Audi limo is a 3.0-litre turbocharged engine that produces 310 brake horsepower. Speed isn't exactly on the agenda, but the A8L Extended is still nippy enough to get it from 0 to 60 in 7.1 seconds. Lamborghini Urus The Lamborghini Urus looks like a true oddball next to the rest of the Italian manufacturer's supercar lineup. It's big, it's tall, and its engine is at the front. This must be some sort of mistake, right? Despite the naysayers, Lamborghini really did pull off their dream of building a luxury, high-performance 4x4. And not only does it beat all of its competitors on the spec sheet, but it looks good whilst doing so. The Urus is not exactly a luxury cruiser, but it's as refined as performance cars get, and there's not a more comfortable 4x4 out there that can match its acceleration or handling. Sitting high and wide, the Urus has a stunning presence, and that recognizable Lambo exhaust note to match makes it a true driver's machine. Detailing is second to none throughout, and everything is finished to the highest standard. From the lightweight, chrome-accented wheels, to the metallic paint job, to the fine leather interior trim. Rolls-Royce Phantom there are very few cars, if any, that can match the ride comfort and refinement of Rolls-Royce's flagship model. The Phantom has a reputation of being the ultimate in luxury motoring, a reputation that has been well and truly surpassed by this year's 2020 facelift. Costing more than your average house, the Phantom is a costly ride by anybody's standards. But buyers that are lucky enough to afford one will be able to experience one of the most luxurious places to spend their time, period, let alone in the world of high-end cars. Dripping with tech inside and out, the latest Phantom is the smartest yet and makes every moment with the car an absolute pleasure. In the back seats, you have reclining leather seats, touchscreen displays, and the famous celestial lit roof. The ride is even more silent than ever before, thanks to upgraded sound deadening in the side panels and the development of special foam core tires. Behind the wheel is a surprisingly fun affair, despite the Phantom being the size of a small sailboat. The huge 6.75-litre V12 produces 536 brake horsepower and can get the Phantom to 60 miles per hour in just 5.3 seconds and keep on pulling to its limited top speed of a respectable 155 miles.